Here we come again. Mm-hmm. Uh, How was your weekend? My weekend was good. A boring game. Boring game. Boring, boring game. Draw. Nil nil. Mourinho once said, um, if, "Boring is a team." Yes, but if you cannot score, mm. do not concede. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, a good weekend. Yeah. And uh, for the betting, how did it go? Things were not that bad. Mm-hmm. But before that, I have a question for yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's so, the question? Um, how many months? Mm. Have twenty uh, eight days in a year. All of them. All of all of them. Rock. All of them. How many months in a year have twenty eight days? Every month has at least twenty eight. <laughs> <Yes. laughs> Somebody was telling me twenty eight because I said twenty eight. And so that like Feb. Uh, February. Some because Feb because <laughs> no. For the first time uh, you've used your brain. And this no. means you're gonna nail it this weekend. For the first time ever since I've met you, since uh No, I've been using my brain, just that we've been unlucky. 19th, On Saturday, uh, actually, uh we lost uh by one goal. One was goal. it Chelsea? Chelsea. Chelsea win. Uh, they were playing against 10 men and it looked like an easy game. I think the complacency continues for that team. Yeah. And uh, on Sunday, yet again, one goal, very early in the morning, Australian, Australian League. League. Uh, we had over 1.5 goals and uh, the first goal was scored in the second minute of the game. And then the game ended that way. So very unlucky, but very good bets. If you yeah. split them, if you picked a few from his side and added on Sunday, I think you... Uh, on Monday we had a win. Yep. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah. And on top of that, our Telegram channel we've mm-hmm. had a lot, a lot of winnings. Back to back wins. Yeah. Trust you me. Uh, if you've not joined our Telegram channel, mm-hmm. please do. And for those who have been asking, do you guys? Uh, I don't have a, ch- a Telegram uh, account. Mm. Now we've created a WhatsApp channel. Yes. We'll be WhatsApp sharing the is. link as well. Yeah. Uh, we just uh, invited people like. Uh, an hour ago and yeah. we, have... we have a lot of people there yes. who are already benefiting from what we have. So remember to check the description section of this video and also the, um, the comment section because the first comment will have all of our socials. Yeah. Telegram, WhatsApp, Instagram, TikTok, wherever, 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 all of them. They'll be there. So yeah, and we try again. And before we continue, before we start giving out our bets, Remember to hit that like button on this video because, uh, yeah, you know you like our content, right? Right. Yeah. So, obviously, I'll start on Saturday, mm-hmm. we do Sunday. Yeah. And just before, uh, there's somebody who commented and said, guys, mm-hmm. be mentioning the league. The leagues of, of these teams. Yeah. Team you yeah. mentioned. Yeah. yeah, true. We'll try. We'll be doing that because mm-hmm. anything you say, of course, we'll, we're gonna do. We're gonna do it. We're gonna deliver it to you. On Saturday, I have around uh, seven teams. That's five plus mm-hmm. odds. Mm-hmm. And like I always say, seven is my lucky number. Lucky number. Yeah. Right here we go. Um, we have Nuremberg from uh, Bundesliga two taking on Holstein Kiel mm-hmm. over two of one point five. Sorry. That is 1.15 odds. Mm-hmm. And uh, later on, Saturday at around 4 p.m. East African time, mm-hmm. from the Italian Syria, mm-hmm. we'll see AC Milan mm-hmm. take on Lecce. Lecce. Lecce, people call it Lecce. Lecce. But it should be Lecce. Of 1.5, mm-hmm. 1.21 odds. Mm-hmm. Then in the Premier League, English Premier League, I have Luton taking on AFC Bournemouth over mm-hmm. 2.5, 1.47 odds. Mm-hmm. And the fourth match uh, from uh, this team, your league, Sandness, mm-hmm. taking on Ranheim. Norway Elite Serian League. Yes, this is the first division yeah. over 2.5, mm. 1.43. Mm. Then team uh, from uh, Hungary, we have uh, Ujbest. Diosgori <laughs> taking, you know, Diosgori taking on Kisvada. 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 Over 1.5. 1.21 odds. Mm. The third match, mm. uh, you are league once again. Bodo Glimit taking Bodo. on. Bodo. Yes. <laughs> taking on Viking. Yep. Over 2.5. Awesome. 1.30 odds. Mm-hmm. And the last one mm-hmm. from Belgium Pro League. Belgium Pro League. We'll see Standard Liege mm. taking on Leuven. Leuven. Over 1.5. 
1.20 mm -hmm. a total of five plus odds absolutely amazing absolutely amazing everything looks good on that bed slip yeah um no doubts about any of the teams but of course uh of, i'll always favor the leagues that are my favorite yeah uh that sandness team and yeah. then we also have the bodog limit versus viking yeah looks like one of the teams that oh, as in the two of them are the teams that i really i know that league yeah well analyzed it's about time to win money again on Saturday. So, great five votes. Thank you. Let's right. go on Sunday. On Sunday, I have everything right here. And my first team on my bed slip is... <laughs> Wait a minute. Sorry. Sorry about that. You, you, you've never used my brain. I was like, how? <laughs> well, the first team on my bed slip is Manchester United versus Liverpool. Wow. Guess the market? Over 6.5. <laughs> Manchester United to score seven goals? What seems to score? You mean over, over 6.5 Manchester United to score seven goals? Yeah. Because I know that's what you want. Anyway, Manchester United versus Liverpool, over 2.5 goals. Let's go with that because I feel like 2-1 win, 3-1 win for that game is possible. If you also like, you can go for both teams to score because I feel like Manchester United at home can grab one and Liverpool might grab one as well or more or depending on how it goes. But I feel like this game will have more than two goals. So over 2.5 goals. And then I have Sparta Prague. This is my favorite Czech Republic, Republic. Liga. It's called Czech Fortuna Liga. And then uh, it's versus Mlada Boleslav. And I have win, home win, and over 1.5 goals. So at least this team should win 2 nil, 3 nil, 3 1, or 2 1, something like that for us to win that bet. Um, remember, Sparta is at the top of the Temple. Czech Fortuna Liga. Yeah. That's why we went with that. And then we have another Premier League team, Tottenham Hotspurs, playing at Tottenham Stadium versus Nottingham Forest. And I believe this game can end in over 2.5 goals. What do you think? Uh, you will let me know later after I read my teams. And then another team from Norway, Elite Serien League, SK Brann versus Fredrikstad, FK, over 2.5 goals again. And then last team on the bet slip is from Cyprus League. And it's Zakakiu versus I Limassol. Let's go with I Limassol to win or draw. So away team, win or draw. DC X2. Double chance. Yeah. Double chance. Yeah. So a total of 5.1 odds. And it depends with whoever you're playing with. I mean, like the bookmaker you're using on your end. And I was about to say, here is the booking code, but no booking codes <laughs> yet again. So that is my bad slip. What do you think uh, about Good this? selection. Yeah. Uh, allow me to pick uh, to emphasize. Mm -hmm. Looks good. Your yeah. bad slip looks good. Mm. Uh, but let me emphasize like three or four games. Mm -hmm. One, Man yeah. United versus Liverpool. Yeah. That's a game which will produce goals. Uh -huh. Two, in the, still in the Premier League. Uh -huh. Tottenham mm. taking on Luton. Yeah. Right? Uh -huh. Over 2.5. So Tottenham taking on Nottingham. To Nottingham, sorry. Yeah, yeah. Uh, of course, I expect at least 3 1 to 1. Mm -hmm. So over 2.5 is very, very safe. Mm -hmm. A win for Limassol. Mm. That's a team uh, which I really, really yeah, uh, value. Yeah. So I think those three, three games I've picked, they, they really look good. Yeah. Also, you can make your own adjustments. Yes, yes, of course. Because yeah. at the end of the day, we had people who played our bets, played your Saturday bet, and they said, luckily, or they, they don't have... You omitted Chelsea. Yeah. Like, I don't know how. No, it's not like how. Uh, it's because he doesn't probably believe in Chelsea. Yeah. And that's what a, a, a proper gambler, online investor will do. Because yeah. we saw Chelsea easy win. Totally. For him, they didn't. He didn't include them. And Mark you, if yeah. we had the code or the booking code, yeah. he might have lost because he would just, just load the code. And Less so it's much. good if we have the list yeah. without the code so that you can also have your own judgment on your side. Yeah. So that is our Saturday and Sunday bed slip. Yeah. And you can also combine them and will be good for you. So you have anything on Monday? On Monday, of course, I have around four teams. Mm -hmm. And here we go. Mm. Brown be taking on Silkeborg mm -hmm. over 2.5. This is the Super League. Brown Bar, yeah. Yes, over 2.5. Super League for Denmark. Yes, yeah. 1.61 odds. Mm -hmm. And the second team is Lubin taking on Gonik mm -hmm. over 1.5. Mm -hmm. uh, that's a team. This is a very hard name. Yeah. It's called Ekrastrak. 
Classer. Extra classer. Yes. <laughs> uh, then uh, that is over 1.5, 1.25. Mm-hmm. Then in the Netherlands, mm-hmm. Erdvisie. There are two. Uh, there is that one you live, and there is this for yeah, Mondays. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a youth one. Mm-hmm. And we have Jong Ajax Amsterdam taking on Den Bosch. Mm-hmm. That is over 2.5. Mm-hmm. 1.52 odds. Mm-hmm. Then the last match on Monday, mm-hmm. we'll see Yudnes taking mm-hmm. on Inter Milan. Mm-hmm. Of 1.5. Ah, looks awesome. Again, yeah. on Tuesday, um, we have the Champions League, bro. Yeah. Champions League where we'll see uh, Big biggest teams. Gun. Yo, sad to say. And that's why actually we are putting on Bayern Munich versus Arsenal because you're going to be interested in our episode for Champions, Champions League. League, which will be soon on our channel. So make sure you hit that notifications button. Don't miss it. Well... Solihull Moors versus Ebbs Fleet. This is England or English National League. National League. Yes. Over 2.5 goals. And then I have Real Madrid versus Man City. Uh, both teams to score or over 2.5 goals, depending on what you want. But I would um, go with over 2.5 goals. Yes. And then I have um, Southampton. Over 1.5 goals. Um, just search the word Southampton on the bookmaker and uh, you'll find it and place over 1.5 goals on the Tuesday bet slip. So around 2.5 odds and here. <laughs> I understand. Are you no full? good again. Are you full today? No good. I, I think this bottle has uh, something. We'll find out later. Okay. Yeah, but a total of around 2.5 odds and that is our Tuesday bet. Right, on Wednesday, mm-hmm. have three teams. I don't know how you pronounce this, but this is from the Scotland. Mm-hmm. Dundee taking on Rangers. Mm-hmm. Uh, straight win for Rangers. Mm-hmm. PSG versus Barcelona. This is the Champions League. Mm-hmm. Over 2.5. Mm-hmm. And the last one, it is Swansea taking on Stock mm-hmm. City. Both teams to score. A safer bet could be over 1.5. And mm-hmm. that's what we have on Wednesday. Right. On Thursday, we have the Europa League uh, and the Conference League. And we have a lot of teams playing, of course. We have Leverkusen taking on West Ham over 2.5 goals. We have Liverpool playing Atalanta. Yeah. You have to go with Liverpool win and over 2.5 goals in that game because I feel like they can win 2-1, 3-1, 4-1. They have been doing so well in the Europa League. And then in the... um, Conference League, we have Aston Villa versus Lille go with over 1.5 goals. And another one, the last one is Victoria Pleasant versus Fiorentina, also over 1.5 goals. A total of around three odds because there are so many teams. You can add yours as well that day. And yeah, that is the Thursday bet. So it looks good. Mm. I forgot to mention we yeah. had 100 and. 13 mm. odds yeah. on Monday. On Monday, yeah. 113 odds on Monday. You can take a look at how this bed slip looks. Yeah. And uh, we had Roma mm. failing. Yeah. Roma Only failing. Only Roma, I Roma, think. it's very uh, sad. It was Roma sad. plus another team. Only mm. two teams. So we had 18 yeah. green mm. out of 20. But if you ask our followers, they will tell you that someone might have cashed out yeah when they saw roma not going because it was almost so. the last team actually so yes yeah right. so there's a possibility someone cashed out something from that bet. so, so ladies and gentlemen nice. uh, always uh, be on our telegram channel yep. now we have our whatsapp channel mm. and facebook that's where we share our all our tips yes yeah daily tips so that is it from our end today yeah people who are asking for the train bets yes we will not forget the train bet and you, what we'll do with the train bet is because we can't list all the teams that we have we'll on look this. for one bookmaker yes we'll look for one bookmaker and have a code so if you belong to that bookmaker then you're lucky enough we will let you know uh, especially on this video we will also put that code and uh, if we will have the code here is where we'll have the code in the comment section as well in the description section as well a train bet of around 200 plus odds that's what we'll have this time round so remember stay tuned in to that because we believe that we will win a train bet very soon and yeah that's it from our end remember to bet responsibly stake what you can afford to lose betting is not for the people who are under the age of 18 years and that's all from us that uh, we've been you've been chilling out with Brian Werimo and Vincent and this, this is, is a little sports show, show.